Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be making my 30 week pregnancy update. I momentarily got confused because I thought that I didn't make my 28 week one yet because it's not posted and then I realized that I recorded it like a week ago and I never edited, edited the video. So I apologize for my slowness of getting these things up. Um, I have motivational issues, but I'm pretty sure I'm starting to get to that like nesting stage because I'm just like wanting to get things cleaned. But hold on. My list of my five things that I have to tell you about 30 weeks, being 30 weeks pregnant, is on my phone, and which I dropped. <laughs> okay, so first I have that my stomach, like my upper abdomen above my belly button have started to hurt when I cough and laugh and sneeze. At one point I was trying not to sneeze at all because I didn't want it to hurt. It almost feels like my muscles are being ripped, which is highly possible because um, that's pretty much where my abs are. Um, if they get ripped, they're not coming back. Um, I've also developed this throat cough and I don't think it's anything bad. If anything, it might be like allergy, sinus drainage. Um, if I'm still having it when I go to my appointment next week, I'm going to mention it, but I don't think it's anything serious because I'm not like, I don't feel bad or anything like that. I feel pretty fine, except now I'm getting a bit tired and um, I have to take frequent breaks. Like I'm currently trying to clean my room, but I thought this would be a good time to make this video but I've had to keep stopping to break because I get tired out and out of breath fairly quickly. Um, if I walk too much, my hips will hurt slightly and it probably has to do with like where, what body part she's resting on or where she's at in my stomach, but uh, that's only happened like twice. It's not something that's really that consistent, so but I did note it. In week 29 is when I started to feel her hiccup for the first time. I didn't know what it would feel like, but I do now. It's pretty obvious that it's uh, hiccup. It's, it's like a very consistent little like thumping in the same place. So I know that those are hiccups. And I've had them about four or five times since. Um, as far as welling goes, I have not had any in my actual like body parts like normally you would get swollen hands or fingers and I don't think I have that problem I don't really wear ring I don't wear rings though so I don't know if there is a slight swelling or not I guess I could totally check that but I just have it um, same with my feet like I don't really wear tight shoes in general so I don't think they're swollen because they don't look noticeably swollen because what I've seen which would be my mom and my sister's feet being swollen like it gets really bad and I haven't seen that in me at all like everything looks pretty good but I also try to keep my legs propped up if I'm sitting and then I do get up to walk around if I'm sitting at work for too long but I am seeing floaters in my eyes which if you don't know what that is it's basically like you see little things flying around that aren't there um, I guess they can be white or black mine what I see are little black specks flying around and apparently it's common in pregnancy it's some part of your eye that I can't think of the actual scientific term for but some part of your eye can get swollen during pregnancy, that's what causes you to see the floaters. So it's totally normal. Other than that, the last thing is that I started to experience restless leg syndrome. And it is the weirdest thing that I've ever dealt with. Like, I just, I get uncomfortable, I have issues sleeping here and there, but it's not too bad. I don't really have a lot of complaints, to be honest, except being out of breath, which is uh, something that I've dealt with for a long time during this pregnancy, and I think it has to do with the fact that I'm tiny. I was already a tiny person, and now I have a little person inside of me that is pushing all of my organs 
in weird places. <laughs> so I have that going for me now. But yeah, two nights ago, I felt my leg being restless for the first time. And it's so weird. Like, I just could not keep my leg still. It wasn't constantly moving, but every few minutes it would. And I was having problems sleeping because of it. Um, I also found out that I need to have both of my body pillows, but I use them both. I have one on either side of me. Um, but that's pretty much about it. I also, I don't think I've experienced Braxton Hicks yet. Um, if I have, I don't know. I don't know what it feels like, uh, to be honest. I don't, I don't know if I've had them or not. Um, my app told me today that I would have them more frequently, and I'm like, I don't know if I've even had them at all. I don't know. She just moves a lot and my stomach feels tight sometimes but that's just because she's like taking up space and there's not much space left to give. Other than that, that's pretty much everything for the update. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you guys next time. Bye!